Maybe we should talk about some higher education news. Here. The European Court of Justice has ruled that the um, higher education law in Hungary is not in line with EU law. The law was made against the um, CEU, the Central European University in Budapest, which is, has been founded by George Soros. And this university has now already moved to Vienna. But, um, however, the court ruling of the ECJ is there. And now, if Hungary doesn't comply, the EU can fine it. Another news very important in Brussels now, there are the negotiations for the multi-annual budget. And the dramatic turn has occurred. The European Parliament budget rapporteur Pierre Laroutourou is on hunger strike. He and other MEPs believe there should be a top-up. There should be extra 39 billion euro for Horizon Europe, Erasmus and other um, forward-looking programs instead of cuts. Well, here, London, researchers in England get more and more nervous because the transition period is nearly over. On the 1st of January, probably we will land with a no deal and it will be tough for UK researchers to continue collaborating with the EU and for Europeans like the 14.4 million scientists and engineers that potentially want to work in the UK will have to face hurdles like visa costs. A visa for a scientist with a family might cost up to 19,000 um, euro for five years. Well, the last news interesting too in Paris, student flats cost now more than in London. <laughs> well, they have risen in the last half year by four to seven percent. Well, um, I gotta go. I want to talk to Peter van der Heiden before we restart uh, with, the, with the show. So, see you there.